Hi, I'm Tony Wynn, uh, Project Leader of Waterfront Arts Project. Um, I'm standing in front of this extraordinary painting um, of Red Rum um, and Southport Beach. You've got the, the shrimpers and the old duck boat, the old pier, and of course Red Rum here. Um, it's facing the, the pier itself here at the waterfront. And this is painted by Rob Newbegin. Rob Newbegin was a, a very notable character in Southport, and I'm glad to say that uh, because he's a fantastic artist, I've managed to trace him. And here's Rob over here. Hi. And uh, Rob and I are uh, talking about Rob coming to Southport and to painting, do some painting here at the Waterfront Arts Project, and uh, be part of an artist in residence programme we've got going on here. And this current exhibition we've got on here is called People, Places and Faces. We've actually got an exhibition of work by photography students from Southport College as well here. This is an extraordinary exhibition. It's got 400 works of art over the 16,500 square feet space we've got here. What do you think of it, Rob? Fantastic. I've never, I think I've ever seen so many paintings in one, one place and uh, what a massive, uh, well-lit place to paint in as well. You know, I know, that half it, the yeah. battle is actually having the light for the paintings to, to look good. Yeah, yeah. There's, there's a lot of natural light in here and yeah. I think that's quite important. A lot of my paintings have been like shown, they've been fantastic paint, but shown in really dark areas, you know, and although the lights come out of them that I've painted in them, you can't, you can't help but a painting look good when it's got the light on it. Yeah, yeah. So where have you been artist in residence before? Um, right, I was at uh, Dobby's uh, Garden World and that really, really worked well. Um, the people were coming to get a brew and would just do a double take. Oh, there's a guy there painting, you know, and would come over. Um, and basically from that, you know, I may or may not have got commissions from, but the, the, the Red Run Tribute paintings, they were actually painted on site. Right. And the, the amount of interest was just phenomenal at the time, you know, and I want to do that again. Um, actually, I live, I've been living in Caton, a little village in uh, All right, near Lancaster. Near Lancaster. Mm -hmm. Fantastic scenery, um, but I've sort of been a, a lost voice on my own there, you know, and been painting like mad. Mm -hmm. um, but I'm, I'm really, really interested in moving back to Southport now. Right. Um, because, you know, to where my roots are. Well, I mean, I was just saying to Rob that Southport is, is one of the most buzzing places now in the north with regards to arts and culture. And uh, the fact that most of the work that you can see in this gallery space is actually by local artists, although we have a few artists from Europe as well. Um, so what we're hoping is that we'll see you working here very Certainly, soon, yeah. in a nice big bay yeah. window at the front. Enjoy, yeah. And then we've got these superb ones of yours as well in the window. You can just about make them out. Superb poppy one here, around that side. Where did you paint this one, Rob? Um, this one I actually painted at home. <laughs> right. It's about the only large painting I actually take. But what I did, I actually took it back into Dobby's and finished it off um, in Dobby's. Um, and again, great, you know, this was the, this was the stealer. This is the one that really, even though the, the Red Run tributes were done for a specific reason, this was the painting I did just because I wanted to paint it. Um, and since then it's given me a lot of ideas, um, especially with Remembering Sunday just gone, you know, it was, it was very apt. Um, mm -hmm. When I heard that you had it in the front window here, I had to come down here to have, actually have a look because it was, you know, it was in a really good place. And over here, we've got your own red rum. <laughs> My paint's everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, um, now this one, now the story with this one, um, Although I do like the, the other red rum picture, this one works the best. Um, I actually was on Facebook chatting to uh, Jo McCain, Ginger McCain's daughter, and this is the one that she said that, that actually caught red rum the most perfect. Yeah. Um, and I was really, really, you know, chuffed with this one. It, some pictures just work, don't they? You know, and. I got him just right. I think that what people say is the water is amazing. Yeah. Although it's self isn't it? <laughs> well, a few people have said it's got to be a lie because <laughs> it's artistic license because the sea is actually coming in, but we, yeah. we do know it comes in here. Oh, yeah, it does, it does come in. I yeah. mean, it, it's the way it comes in. I used to be a beach lifeguard at Southport, and I kind of know where the, the troughs are and then the gullies, you know, and, and yeah, yeah that's, right. that's the way it used to come in, all right. Yeah. Um, yeah. Yeah, it's beautiful. All right, Rob. Well, thank yeah. you very much indeed. Okay. We look forward to working with yeah. us. 
Um, and thanks very much indeed to Southport GB.